Welcome to Life with Lenochi. I'm obviously Michael Lenochi, and this is the first one. Uh, this week I'm going to talk about my first helicopter ride. Uh, I've never done one of these before, but I'm going to keep putting these out on my YouTube channel, uh, Michael Lenochi's YouTube channel. Uh, so make sure to subscribe, like the video, share the video, do all the things that everybody always asks you to do when you watch a video in the beginning and it's annoying and you have to skip past it. So that's what I'm asking you to do. I went on my first helicopter ride. Uh, this was uh, something I uh, was, I, 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 it was not expected. I did not know I was going on a helicopter ride. It was a surprise to me. It's a small one that only fits four people. So that's already like, whoa, this is crazy. Only four people can fit in this fucking helicopter. I had never been on one in my whole life. And we went uh, out of a, a place in Burbank. I know what some of you, some of your first thoughts of uh, your a helicopter in LA is like, uh oh, uh, is that safe? Uh, most most of the time it is safe. Mo uh, outside of a couple stories you've heard, um, helicopter rides are pretty safe. A helicopter license is actually harder than a pilot's license. Um, that being said, the pilot was 27. He was young. He was younger than uh, t 10 years younger than me. I could tell. He was, um, he was somebody who wouldn't crash helicopters, I guess. I don't know. Um, I'm going to take you through some of the shots I got. I got a bunch of shots on my cell phone so uh, we could look at it. Uh, first shot, I got to say, could I be a director in Hollywood? Just the, just the presentation of the Hollywood sign from the shot that I took right there, that's a perfect that's a perfect shot. It looks like the intro to a movie. It looks like, oh, okay, we got a good Hollywood movie coming through here. It's a good, it's a good B-roll shot. I would say that this could be used in future films or future, uh, future episodes of Life with Lenochi. This could be used as my intro video to Life with Lenochi. The tour was only like maybe 40 minutes long, but in 40 minutes you could pretty much get most of LA. The only part we didn't go down was uh, down towards downtown around the skyscrapers, which would have been cool. Capitol Records building, you go, you head over that. We fly over West Hollywood. That's when you're flying over some of the m more expensive houses in the world. I mean, first of all, they said that's uh, um, Jeff Bezos' house. Bezos, am I saying that right? Uh, and then they start calling out all the houses like, hey, that's Justin Bieber's house, which I think I have. That's Justin Bieber's house. Uh, that's Dan Bazillionaire's, B Barzillion Bazaar Bazaar house. Dan, B B the fucking poker player who's basically like the modern day Hugh Hefner. That guy's house. And of course there's like some fucking yellow car, like a yellow sports car out front of it. Above that is like some huge ass mansion that takes like 40 employees to uh, keep functioning or something like that. Magic Johnson's house, that's right here. So, I, you know, I don't know if I'll get in trouble for this, but that's Magic Johnson's house. I remember that one specifically because I was like, how is there not a basketball court, but there's a tennis court? Um, there was also, uh, we also have, um, I think they, they picked out um, Denzel Washington's place, uh, Sylvester Stallone's place. He had like two places connected to each other. Basically, when you're up in the hills, you realize that you'll never have that life when you see it from up there. Because when you're driving around Hollywood and you're like looking up at the hills, you're like, oh, that's my dream. One day I want to get a house up there. Hopefully I'm successful enough and then I can get a house up there. But when you're in a helicopter, you're like, oh, I'll never have a house up there. That's crazy because it's impossible because these houses are hundreds of millions of dollars and I'm 37. So how am I going to get to afford something like that? So, um, and then we head out to Marina Del Rey. Marina Del Rey, from the bird's view, looks pretty amazing. The thing about LA is it's not a boat town. It's not like South Florida. Like I'm from South Florida, uh, back in Fort Lauderdale, Miami. A lot of friends, uh, now that I'm in my 30s, in my 20s they didn't, but in my 30s, I have a lot of friends that have boats and stuff. So it's such a boat vibe. On the weekends, like, hey, 
Let's go on the boat. Let's relax. Let's go out on the intercoastal. That's not really the vibe in LA. I'm sure there is a scene where people go on the boat on the weekend if you live in Marina Del Rey. But my whole point is like, there's not a lot of people I know that are like, yo, you want to go on the boat? Not, you don't know a lot of people that own boats in the Hollywood scene. That's just, it's just not a boat vibe. And then that's us over Santa Monica, headed towards Santa Monica. You can see uh, the Santa Monica Pier. And at, at this view right here is breathtaking. Probably the best view of the whole trip is Santa Monica Beach because you're looking it up. It's very beautiful. It's a beautiful beach. And then you, uh, you can see north is, is headed towards uh, Malibu. So that's when we directed back towards uh, Burbank, towards the hangar. What's interesting is when you come in the landing for the helicopter, it's landing like a plane. They still go by the rules. Even though a helicopter could just come in, hover, and then go straight down, they still, in the Burbank, they still come in through the runway and then get low and then go to the left and then they go to the bunker and then they land. Like it's, it's just interesting they do it as if they were a plane. So that was, I thought, interesting. I suggest you guys try it out. Um, that was my first helicopter ride. I wasn't scared, I wasn't nervous. I, 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 I thought I might have, because I'm afraid of heights. I'm afraid of heights, naturally I'm afraid of heights. Like if I'm, uh, if I'm in a tall building and I'm in the balcony and I look over, I get sweaty palms. I get, my, pant, my palms get clammy from just watching videos of those guys hanging off towers or jumping from roof to roof. I'm getting clammy hands just talking about it. So I would think that, oh, maybe I'm gonna be a little nervous for this helicopter ride, but I wasn't at all. I got in, I was actually really excited and I enjoyed it. So that's pretty much my helicopter ride experience. Uh, this is my first time doing this. I'm gonna put out more Life with Lenochi videos. Again, if you like it, subscribe. You can subscribe by hitting the little emblem on the corner right there at the bottom. Thanks, thanks for watching, guys. We'll, uh, we'll, I'll see you whenever I do my next one, I guess. Bye.